Hey guys, this is, Fr- this is Fritz, and today I will teach you how I do my art. And um, I actually don't do s- stretch, so first of all, we're just gonna find a fine color for our face pictures. I'm I'm actually supposed to draw my boyfriend's OC, but I decided to draw my real life OC because why not? And um, of course, fr- first of all, we're just going to have uh, um, the light like so um the layers the transparent i don't know what it's this called okay so we're just gonna put away the white stuff first and let's just, we're gonna sketch our face like on the face i mean we're not really sketching like um we're just gonna draw the f- the head first wait and we're gonna make sure there's no gap like when you're actually drawing it um so, after making the the head, we're just gonna fill it up with paint like I just just seen, and we're just gonna um we're just gonna paint at it, and we're also gonna make the neck. The neck doesn't really really matter since um there's some clothes gonna cover it up. It's, yeah, it doesn't really matter if you the end of the neck since we're the, we're not really gonna draw the body and etc and stuff so we're just also gonna fill it up with paint too and there you go we had the neck and the head too so we're just gonna paint that out of course we're just also gonna paint that out because we don't want any gap when we're actually um shading it up and now let's go for the for the um um hair it doesn't matter what color what you use to the hair it really is your choice the length of the hair really doesn't matter it also go with your choice of the length same with the hair color really that really matter what kind of shape you do with the hair it's really your choice when you um not this swiggly line <laughs> just the hair. no 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 um but of course we can make sure it's actually in the hair and after we make some gaps, uh, this part is, uh, wait a minute, let's just put some clothes first because, um, it's kind of hard, <laughs> so we're, just like I said, your choice of matter when it goes to the clothes too, so, um, I'm gonna make a sweater, something, um, sweater clothes. The clothes it goes with your matter too. How you um do the clothes, of course. Um, we're also the the same as we do the face. That is also the same way we're gonna do the clothes, of course. And after we line the clothes, we're also gonna fill it up with paint again. Mm-hmm. And also the side of the hair, really. The, yeah. That's the hair is not our priority yet, so we just gonna fill it up. After we actually done with the hair, we are going to, I mean not the hair, I mean the clothes. We're just going out the hair. After we done with the clothes, we're going to the hair now. So, so wait, wait. So we're going to do with the hair now after the clothes. Mm-hmm. So. We're also going to fill it up, but first of all, we're just going to do this part first because because we also doing a back hair, and the back hair is if you don't do actually do the back hair and just do the front hair, it's kinda give the art a bit um thing, and it's going to make you um suffer because you also have to erase the thing so you can look for the back. Part. but first we're just gonna do the the front and after the front we're just gonna do the back just like I said but first we're gonna fill this up of course and also the clothes that we're actually supposed to cover up earlier and if you're just being lazy use um, a bigger brush to co- cover it up <laughs> I mean to if you actually want to make it faster um, and after covering that up um, so, so after that, so after that, we do the, the back. But first, we have 
to fill it up the front hair first. Now let's do the back. Okay, the back, you should actually have a darker shade of the color that you're using for the back because if you don't, you're just gonna get um, confused with the color, of course. Um, now, we're just gonna do some face. Um, I use airbrush for, for the sh and for shadowing the brush. That's what I use. So, um, do airbrush 60 the edges don't need it to be um, sharp it is your own matter of choice if you want it sharp or not blah 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 first we're just going to um, use the first shade after the first shade we're going to have the second shade the second layer because we need the first layer to not cut with the first with the second layer the first layer not cut with second if you get what I mean now we're gonna do a second one and more darker of course and of course we always need to um, put shadow under in in the ch under the chin of course you can always um, blur that part with the chin it really your matter of choice really if you want and you can always erase it up for me, I always erase that up. So, and sorry for the noise. It's kind of raining, and I'm kind of outside as recording this. So, and the th the third shadow is always it's finally gonna put it to the second layer because it doesn't really matter. The only matter is you, you don't actually put it to the first layer for the sh the face because um. I mean, if you actually accidentally put a layer and cannot delete it, um, we're gonna start our all over again. <laughs> so yeah, it's totally fine. And uh, and now we're just going to do the nose. This is how I actually shadow the nose. And the nose need to be a darker shade than the the rest. And so after you done with the nose, you're going to make a contour or something. And because if you don't, um, it's kind of like not going with the color of the forehead and stuff. And we're, we're also going to blend the side of the nose, not the pointy part, okay? Not the pointy part, but the side of the nose. So there we go, we, we're done We're done with the nose. I mean, not really done yet with the face. We're not done with the face, but we're done with the nose. So... If you want to highlight it, press add. So your choice if you actually want to put highlights before putting the uh, um the eyes first is your matter of choice how you put it. And after you're done with that, we're you're gonna put the lips and the teeth. It's your choice. But I go with teeth first, so we're doing teeth first. The, the shape of the teeth is also your point here, okay? It's your own opinion, of course, not mine. How you draw your teeth. I'm just here at how I paint my... <laughs> how I do my art, so... After, after the teeth, you're, of course, gonna cover it up with the lips 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 the lips color is also your matter of choice I, ha I have some reddish lips in real life although it don't really go when it comes to camera um yeah so i'm not gonna draw my big lips here so no <laughs> no 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 so um just like i do Oh, the lips is kind of small. We're just gonna um, turn it big. Uh, wait a minute. Okay, we're just gonna put it there. Okay, maybe not. Let's not have uh, my natural big lips, no. <laughs> okay, wait, let's not. Okay. So, we're gonna go with the hair now. And... And I kind of have colorish hair in real life. I kind of have 
some red um, faded down in my hair so we're after, and we're also doing the back color but darker again okay so we're okay uh, um, we're gonna use the fa faded one the pen the pen the faded one so we're going here okay the technique in, th in this one is kind of give you like that hairish like tips of your hair like your natural real life hair like that okay um so sorry if i kind of make a slow puck in the hair because i'm kind of doing this sideways i'm not i normally do with this not sideways um or clockwise or something but since i want to do a full vid of this i'm gonna do um a, a clockwise or just sideways i don't really get what it, that, that that top but the point here you just go and make sure you have the point of the top make sure you have like an angle because that is kind of like like normal hair in real life you like the point the middle part like the, something and like the center of your hair um yeah and yeah that really is a goal when you're doing this kind of technique with the hair i kind of have um wavy hair so my hair is kind of wavy in this art so yeah Uh, and also it's fine if it you're if the fainted um it don't really go natural flow with the base color um yeah the color in the back in the hair is actually just a base color but yeah. it's fine that but it's fine to not now we're doing the back too also darker shade again is always needed to be here okay darker shaded and uh, and again doesn't matter if it doesn't go with the base of the color okay we're doing another one and remember when it when you're doing the faded color technique here you must remember that you're using a darker color when you're doing this technique because if you're just going with the natural hair flow with the color base it kind of doesn't show the ha the color it doesn't show okay oops i kind of <laughs> so that is a technique here you must you mustn't blend the, the technique with the base color that is actually the point that's why it's like a natural flow of hair that is the technique we're going here okay and we're just gonna cook and the middle part we need to um shallow it up darker the point the point is the 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 center of the hair must be a darker color so yeah that's kind of like the thing like like the natural hair and stuff when you're not sure after your hair was fainted like the back thing and now we're doing um highlights to the hair okay here's the thing it that really doesn't matter if you um do the technique like thing like stuff like i'm doing here i'm not really doing the those techniques with the highlights i just blended the highlights because just like real life hair it just blended blended here is thing we're just going to blend it okay we're gonna blend it out and we're just gonna yeah like one of this okay and we're also going going to blend the back hair because why not you can always not blend the back hair or you can always but it's your matter of choice here your matter of choice if you want to blend it up part then again darker shade again darker the highlight 
must be a darker shade okay and also i'm using add thing you can just see how how i do it now we're just going to the eyes and by the way i'm very very bad at making eyes eyes shapes so so just trust the process how i do the eyes okay like i said i'm not good with the eyes okay not good with the eyes like you can see here i'm struggling to make the eyes um and also i'm doing the eyes outer of the hair but to me you can always put it underneath the hair to make it more realistic and like real life thing eyes but that's your own point so but my eyes are kind of big so we just kind of make it smaller smaller the better okay not bigger the better no 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 we're not doing that um Although the eyes is kind of ugly, just trust the process here, okay? Just like I said, I'm bad at it. Okay? So, yeah. Okay, after we do that, we're just gonna raise the extra part that make the eyes ugly. Okay? That prop, that thing is ugly. So, erase that part, erase it. And we're, you're also supposed to in the part when i erase the thing i use um an airbrush to as uh as i um erase the thing and and now we're doing the other part if you're lazy like me you can always copy and paste it copy and paste it like i do because i'm lazy i don't want to draw another piece of eye so if you're lazy like me just do what i do and so we're now we're just gonna color the eyes the eyes okay so we're gonna merge the two layers copy and paste that layers just like what you see here okay and i'm also doing the mirror mirror ruler thing okay because like i said i am like to do to do the other eye <laughs> Yeah, too late to do the other eye. Okay? Don't judge me, okay? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I have kind of problem here. Uh, I mean, um... Uh, I think I just made some mistake here. Uh, okay, never mind. I did not. Wait, wait. Uh, so, I've... Colored it up. Color it up. Now we're go going to shadow the eyes. Okay. Um, darker the better. <laughs> as black as my soul. Yeah. And we're going to blend it. Blur it up. Okay. You can see, I can see some gaps here. So we're just gonna fill it up with white again. As I, uh, okay. Okay. Come here with white, white, white. Okay, okay, okay. It's kind of weird. Look weird. Now we're doing another layer for the for the pupils, pupils, the yeah, pupils of the eye. The color is also a choice of matter. Sorry, I'm bad at making circles. Okay, I'm bad at making circles. Don't judge me, okay? I'm bad at it. I'm bad at it. Now, after the, we do that, we're also going to do another layer. Just for the eyes, of course. Just for the eyes. And shadow it up. Shadow, shadow. And if you don't do this this technique for the eyes, find. Um, and you're going to um, lower the thing of the layer the color uh that uh okay. maybe um and now we, i don't really know how to do a realistic eyes okay realistic eyes now now we're going to um 
do some highlights to the eyes okay highlights we're also going to use add again uh, wrong layer wrong wrong I mean not really just we uh, I think I made it messier uh, and by the way I'm just actually talking I'm just done recording the thing as I I'm just editing the video as I speak okay so I cannot really do anything back so the highlights I mean like the sparkle thing is actually a matter of choice because there are some sparkle choices to the, to the, the thing like yeah I'm really bad at, at highlighting the eyes so uh, if you have a technique for the eyes cool I'm bad at it okay so stop it and we're just gonna do the big eyebrow because I have real life big eyebrows okay bigger and this is going to be an ugly eyebrow <laughs> yeah that's feeling this is so hard layer 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 yeah oh i think this oh this is ugly but then again we can always erase it uh yeah it's ugly erased my real life eyebrow is kind of big so um eh, i shouldn't have just put it under the thing but yeah i forgot to put it on un under the thing actually so yeah so if you want to do more details you can always more put details like the thing like make it realistic eyebrows so realistic eyebrows <laughs> i forgot to do there in the eye yeah and like i said i'm not good with the eyes I'm ha i haven't found the perfect face technique or something so except for actually shadowing the shadowing the face if you're again if you're lazy again just like me copy and paste the eyebrows too because like fancy it's like bruh so now we're just going to prop that together now we just need is to shadow the clothes um shadow clothes and sorry if the layer is kind of whipped because this i actually cut this video out okay i use a dark color here into shadowing the clothes and how you shadow the clothes really is your own thing and how you do it and uh after you shadow the clothes um the, in the black color the thing you're gonna do here is to lower that thing yeah that, it's kind of like you just use the color purple and now we're just gonna do the background of it the background doesn't really matter you can always put no background or not your point of choice to the background but but me I want to do something fun to the background. We're not putting in some sim some thing like a thing here. So um, we're just gonna gonna put some designs here. So like design, it really doesn't matter if we what background you use. This what what background I want. I'm putting some grass. Cause why not? And maybe the color of the. This is not the color I want for the background. Wait, let me just turn it to, to some blue. Blue. Blue, blue. Blah, blah, blah. blah. Now, like the sky. And I'm not going to shadow that up. Nah, never mind. We're not gonna shadow. And we're gonna put some trees. Okay. Tray. Tray, tray, trees. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, uh, no. Darker. Okay. There we go. There we go. And now we're gonna put some highlights. Like, 
the sun is shining. The shining sun. <laughs> now I look. <laughs> so. Like yellow. I use yellow. And now, we're gonna use... Add again. Add. Okay. Now the shadow... We're, like the shadow we're going to use is clouds if I actually can find clouds um be patient with me I'm finding the clouds or I'm just stupid <laughs> uh, uh, wait 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 uh, where is this cloud clouds where are you where are you did I miss it wait wait <laughs> Wait, oh god, where is it? Wait, 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 um, oh, no, no, that doesn't, doesn't know, uh, as I make this video, my parents actually thought and I'm talking to my boyfriend, <laughs> oh, funny, no, I'm just making videos here, uh, okay, my boyfriend is on school, so stop mentioning him in the background. <laughs> okay. Uh, wait. Here's here's a cloud. Okay. Clouds. Uh, no. Now that there you go. Cloud. Now it looked like a painting. Although it's too light. Uh, but there you go. That's how I do it. Now I just need to do is my signature. Of course, my signature. The signature. Me. Yeah. And after the signature, that's how you do it. You perfect. I mean, if if this actually can help you, I mean, it's how it's signature. So, yeah. Thanks, guys, for watching. Bye. Love ya. Mm hmm. Bye bye.